Keep It Locked on your best mix of music, 98.4 Capital FM, where I'm joined by Kendi. Hey, 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 Yo. hey. How are you? I thank you. How are you? Very well, thank you. Thank you so much for joining me in studio. Thank you for having us. So I, and of course, accompanied by Timothy. Hey. Hey, Timothy. Oh, okay. So I'm going to ask you to just drop the mic. I forgot to do that. If you could, oh, maybe my cameraman can help you. Oh, there we go. Kendi's going to do it. There we go. Yep. To the rescue. <laughs> Fantastic. Listen, thank you so much for joining me coming into the studio. Yeah. As you know, that the segment is really about um, artists who are getting into it and, and just starting to get, you know, starting to put their music out there a little yes. more. Mm-hmm. So, Candy, first question I have for you yeah. is how long have you been doing music? And you, this could include singing in the shower, by the right. way. Right. Yeah. <laughs> I just made it a little wider. Yeah. Great. If it includes singing in the shower, I started singing from as early as when I was five. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, the usual cliche story, but it's true for me. I started following my mom in church. My mom sings in church. And so I'd follow her every other Sunday and I'd sing in school. Mm. Yeah. I've always been quite the singer. And then my tattoos in the streets, (laughs) just singing everywhere. So do you hear lyrics everywhere? Do you hear music everywhere? Yes. I usually ask any Betty, who's the singer and yeah. I have friends who are musicians yeah. so they, they tell me this yeah it's true or sometimes even just making like songs singing songs out of real life situations yeah. so it just pops up yeah it does something happens and then you just get a song out of it yep that's a different part of the brain for <laughs> sure <laughs> <laughs> so do you write your own music as well yes I do okay yes. all right and you're accompanied by Timo on the guitar it's Timothy yeah. uh, how long have you been playing the guitar for Um, I've been playing now for eight years Okay. Yeah, I started. Uh, after you look eighteen, class eight. so you what? Know, <laughs> so that looks like you started at ten, but Whoa. that's just me. <laughs> no, I'm actually twenty two. Oh, there you go. Not far. You know, yeah. that's, that's cool. It's four years though. Black don't crack. Let's go on. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah. You've been playing for for around eight years. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you know, with a guitar, I I once had um, Ben Soul, I think, who told me that you have to play it all the time. You strum it. Yeah. continuously you know to keep your hands and you and you could play it and practice for a very long time for a very long time because you see when you're playing guitar you can be doing so much else you could be watching a series you could be listening to music you could be even studying <laughs> and you just so, play the yeah, guitar so yeah you play all the time all the time your fingers don't get tired no did they get tired in the beginning in the beginning yeah it really okay. hurts it does i can't lie okay yeah all right, and you but you persevered. Yeah. And here you are. Yeah, I'm no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I'm going to have Candy, or rather I have Candy on on the show in this segment. Uh and please tell me the first song that you're going to perform. So the first song I'm going to do is Gravity. And I picked Gravity as a first song because Tim actually wrote it and he allowed me to co-write. <laughs> yes, so it's a song that we love to do. It's a happy song. Okay, happy much. happy is good. Yes. I love happy. Yes. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Gravity's calling and I keep on falling, but let me down so low. And there I lay. Every time I get here, letting all the fear consume me whole. I don't think I'll be okay. Gravity's calling and I keep on falling, but let me down so low. And there I lay. Every time I get here, letting all the fear consume me whole. I don't think I'll be okay. But what I don't know is within me is the part it's just to be happy. I won't let the smile in me be forced to frown. It ain't anywhere else. It's in you. You just gotta be the one to pull yourself through. And when the going gets tough, for what you gon' do? Keep your head up high, gotta stand tall, you'll get through it all. It ain't anywhere else, it's in you, you, you. You just gotta be the one to pull yourself through. 
And when the going gets tough, well, what you gon' do? Oh, keep your head up high, gotta stay tall, you'll get through it all. Oh, 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 oh. Gravity's calling, and I keep on falling, pulling me down so low. And there I lay, 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 lay. Every time I get here, letting all the fear consume me. Oh, oh, I don't think I'll be okay. But what I don't know is within me is the part I choose to be happy. I won't let the smile in me be forced to frown. It ain't anywhere else. It's in you. Oh, you just gotta be the one to pull yourself through. And when the going gets tough, for well, what you gon' do? Keep your head up high, gotta stand tall, you'll get through it all. Oh. Oh. So when are you recording uh, an album? <laughs> <laughs> Good question, which uh, has come our way a lot, but soon. So soulful. Where Thank do you, you get your soul from? I think for me, it just runs from the passion I have for singing inside. And and it happens so easily. It's not something that I have to take hours to channel. Like just immediately I start singing. It just, I mean, all nerves disappear and the passion just oozes out. And mm. Where do you get the inspiration to write your songs? So um, I like to tell stories, for one, um, stories about me, stories about other people, and sometimes even um, stories out of imagination. For instance, this song, Heartfelt Expression, um, was a song I wrote, I mean, at, at some point of my life where I was looking at my friends or even friends of friends and what they were going through. And you know how sometimes you just um, feel sort of like unworthy because of different reasons? Yeah, and so I thought... I mean, it would be lovely to have a song that someone can use to cry out. And that's why this song is called Heartfelt Expressions. I agree. I yeah. feel that, you know, people do need to let their emotions out. If yeah. you keep them in, you, you get sick. True. It, it makes you feel sick. And mm. I always say that music is a healer. So if it gets helps you get your expressions out, then you're doing yep. absolutely great. I agree. So your voice. Uh, your thank voice, you. your performance, your everything. <laughs> thank you. You're so going to go so far. I don't even realize thank you. you know how far you're going to be. Thank I don't even think you realize this. I'm just really happy that I had you in this moment in time. Thank you. In the studio. Because, yo, Angie, yeah? Yeah. 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 Thank yeah. you. I Thank don't you. think you realize it. Thank you but so you will much. look back. It might feel a bit surreal right now. You yeah. will look back and remember. You don't realize how far you're going. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. so. No, thank you for sharing <laughs> your time on the studio. and. Timothy, thank you so much as well for thank coming you. into the studio. I really appreciate I mean, that. Yeah. Really, really appreciate that. Yeah. We hope to see some more of Kendi and check her out on her social mediums. That is at Kendi Nkonge, N-K-O-N-G-E, Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook? Yes, Facebook. And Facebook yes. as well. So there you go. Mm-mm-mm. Mm. The movie's coming out, by the way. It's going to be on uh, our yeah. website in just a little while.